Ooh, child, I look like I just got off work. Because I did. Ooh, all right, lighting looks pretty good. All right, let's get this show on the road. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Vinia McKell. Thank you so much for being here with me today. Today is day 7 of 25. It's only been 7 days, huh? Okay. That's 25 minus 7 is... Eight, is that 18 more days? Okay, we can do it. We can do it. It's also 18 days to my birthday. I'm doing 25, instead of 25 days of Christmas, we're doing 25 days of content. My birthday is September 25th. So if you're seeing this during the month of September, you are seeing it live during my 25 days of content. If not, you can still engage and enjoy the content even past September. I am on a journey to 1,000 subscribers. Um, I, My goal was 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. Do we know if we'll make it? Absolutely not, but it's okay. I'm grateful for everyone that I've gained along the way. I've officially crossed over the 500 subscriber, 500 subscribers. I'm super excited about that, and I'm just happy to have you all. I have, I have the best subscribers in the whole world. I love you all so much. So if you're thinking about it, you see this video, you want to support my journey to 1,000 subscribers, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And with that scared me. Child, something fell. Whew. I don't like noises that I don't know is going to be noises moving in the house. You know what I'm saying? Like, announce yourself before you move. Plastic bag. Okay. Anyway, today is, um, I'm super passionate about supporting small-owned businesses and black-owned businesses, small black-owned businesses, big black-owned businesses. So today is going to be a body care fragrance haul from all black-owned businesses. And I'm super, super excited. I love to support. It's like one of my things. I try to incorporate as much black-owned, small-owned content as I can. In March, I did a We Still Black History Month, um, which is just taking the time uh, past Black History Month to still recognize black-owned businesses. I'll have the playlist linked here. Um, and I just am super passionate about it. So... I have like a couple things from three different brands. So I think that's all I have to say. Let's get into it. So this first company, I believe their name is Shea Bakery. It's either Shea Bakery or Shea Makery. I can't remember. Um, wait, let's wait to see what this says. Shea Makery. Shea Makery. Um, I've actually had this box to review for a, you know, a little while now. But we're not going to talk about that. we here now. Praise the Lord. Um, and her creativity is out of this world. Like, she makes... I've never had her stuff before, but just looking at her pictures and stuff on Instagram and stuff, I'm like, I have to try her stuff. I have been wanting to try her stuff for so, so long. So, I'm super excited to have a... Uh, I purchased a couple things from her. So, um, we can start with this because it's right here on the top. This is... Crumbs plus Silk Fizzy... Cr so, let me just show you. So... <laughs> This is in the scent Waffle Cone, and this is Fizzy Crumbs and Bath Oil, combined, I believe. And let me tell you, I could smell this through the packaging. Drop Fizzy Crumbs into water to release fragrance. Drizzle oil into bath water for silky smooth skin. So there must be an oil in here, too. Okay, hold on. I didn't open this. Oh, there is something else in here. So the crumbs are in here, but then there's also, I didn't even know this was in here. Oh, can y'all see that? That is so cool. So, I guess when you take your bath, you put these little things in there. Let's see the inside. Looks just like sand or something. Oh, this smells really, really good though. Hmm. So, I put this in the bath and also put these oils in there. And then have a time. That look like that's the only instructions. All right. That's so exciting. Look at me ready to take a bath now. Okay, y'all, look at this. These are soap bars. Do y'all see that? Smells a little. It says, it's a piece of cake soap bars. Look how cool. Oh, my God. Do y'all see this? It's soap, but it literally looks like cake. How cool! I 
can smell it through the packaging. This smells so good. Look at the, I mean, look at the detail with the icing and everything. How cool. Mmm. So it came with two of these. I'm super excited to use this. And I feel like I already kind of have a routine in my head what I'm going to do. Oh my god. She also put some free soap in here. It's gummy bear. So it looks like she put two of them in here actually. And she put these little, I think you shower with these or maybe these are soap savers. Maybe they're soap savers You put because the, they were in the soap like this. Um, what's this one? Is this the same thing? Yeah, it's free. So she put two of them in here. So this is one. I don't know if you guys can, I don't know if you can see that like, it's like, looks like little gummies are actually in here like bears or something. Um, oh, it smells good. So I got two of those. Ooh, that smells really good. The texture is like soft too. It literally looks like gummy bears are in here. Can y'all see that? Ooh. That smells really good. I also ordered this uh, strawberry cheesecake body oil. Which actually, let's open this up right now. Because strawberry cheesecake and a body oil? Be ready to eat me yet. Oh. Did y'all see that? Oh my god. Oh my god. I done put on too much. Ooh. No, no, no. Oh my god. This smells really good. And let me tell you, I done already put on too much from just like two sprays. This gonna last you. Mmm. And I actually smell the, sm the strawberry and I smell a little bit of like graham cracker or there's something bakery in here it's not it's not very prevalent you do have to smell it like put your nose up to it but mmm this is good look at my arm girl you might be on to something with this one you might be on to something and then I got strawberry cheesecake in the body mist as well Let's see what homegirl is hitting on. Ooh. That was a good mist. Oh. I need to have to put it to my nose. Mmm. That smells really good. But let me tell you, that body oil is where it's at. That smells good, though. But that body oil... Mm-hmm. I would probably wear this at night. I would even probably like maybe spray this on my sheets or something. I don't think, to be honest, just from smelling it on my arm, I'm not, ooh, it smells really good though. I'm not going to say you're going to get the most projection out of it or anything. Like, don't think you're going to put this on and you're going to make the whole room smell good. But just to add, you know, layering to your body care routine or whatever, or just to like spray in the room or spray on your sheets or something, I could see that. But that body oil so far, that body oil is going to be a time. And then I also ordered a couple candles. Yeah. Look at this candle. How stinking cute. Look at that. I have to take it out so y'all can really see. Oh my God. The cappuccino candle. Look at that. Do y'all see the details on that? I don't want to burn it because like what like how do you get rid of I don't want to burn this this is a genuine coffee scent like if you don't want a coffee smell burning in your place then you don't but if you just want something cute something decorative oh my gosh I can see people even using this if they have like a coffee bar area or whatever and they just want something that looks cool just keep this on your coffee bar or whatever. Like, there's so many things you can do with this besides burn it if you don't want to. Because it's just, it's so pretty. Let me say, this is strong. This is strong. I can see this making my whole place smell good. Y'all, I don't know what to do. I don't want to burn it. 
I think I'm just going to admire it for a while. Ooh. This smells like a coffee shop. Like you just walked into Starbucks. That's exactly what this smells like. And I'm not going to say I, I would be in the mood for this every day. But when I am in the mood for it. This is going to. Oh it smells just like I walked into a Starbucks. That's what this smells like. This is the cappuccino candle. <laughs> and I also got this little loofah. I can't remember if I bought this or she threw this in. But I think I bought it. Because it was like. Like a dollar or something. Just a little loofah. Just a little pink. Little cute. Something to travel with so you don't got to bring your, your big uh, loofah. Just a cute little one. And then last but not least, the piece de resistance. This is a banana pudding candle. Hand poured, it says. Are y'all ready to see this? Look at that. Oh my god. Can y'all see the details? Is it detailing? Can you detail the details? Look at it. You can't tell me this is edible. And you want me to burn this? This is three wicks too. How? How can I burn this? Why would I burn this? This is so cool. I don't know what to... Oh, it smells... It literally... I'm not exaggerating. It smells like banana pudding. Like somebody auntie, somebody grandma that made the banana pudding and served it in a bowl. And you want me to burn this? <sighs> Y'all, go to Shea Makery. Get your candles. Get... She has a lot of stuff. She actually has quite a few more things that I want to try. This was just to start me off, but I can already tell you. I'm going to have to go back. And her packaging, like... It's like she she's so good. Like I'll put some pictures of like some of the things on her page or whatever just so you can get an idea. Like she's really into careful into details. Like I'm a fan. Like this is my first time ordering from her. I don't care. Like I'm a hundred percent a fan. Like shout out to you, girl. You doing your thing. That is Shea Maker. I'll put all the links and everything in the description box below. Okay, so I have two quick things here from T Butters. Tea Butters, can you see the name? She is based here in Michigan. But shout out to her though. Or maybe this is a better... Uh, yeah, you can see it like that. Tea Butters. Um, I just ordered two of the Whip Body Butters. Shout out to her. Because she bought her business. For putting a little cooler thing in there. So that it doesn't melt in transport. I love when businesses pay close attention to detail. That is like something that will get me to be a repeat customer when I can tell that you are like meticulous and you take your time and you think things through. That is the easiest, quickest way for me to be a repeat customer. We've got the pomegranate whipped body butter. Let's get into it. Texture, texture shot. Okay. Okay. Now I can tell you this. I like the texture. Like, um, ooh, I didn't even need to grab that much. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Uh, look at that shine. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's going on like oil. Now, I like that. Oh my gosh, the texture. I like that it's wet. Because, like, straight shea butter, to me, sometimes it's hard to put on. Like, you be having to warm that thing up in your hands like it's a heat lamp or something. You be having to... But this literally... You might be on to something with this, sis. Yeah, the texture. I really, really like the texture. Um, And then this is in the scent Baby Butter. We love that, love that. Okay. Okay, I'm seeing what you're putting down. The texture and the, the way it goes on is impeccable. Like, they are on to something with this because that'd be my one gripe with shea butter. It'd be like, the texture. I don't feel like putting in eight hours worth of work just to put lotion on in the morning. Like, I don't got time. I need to grab it, rub it on and go. And this is going to allow me to do that. So I am very, very, very excited about that. Shout out to you. I think her name is, hold on, let me get the card. I think it said Tierra. 
I believe that's right. Shout out to you, Tierra. Oh, tea butters, Tierra. I get it. Oh, that's so cute. Shout out to you, girl. You did your thing. Thank you for paying attention to details. Um, this consistency texture you got going on here, girl. Girl, my skin is grease in my eyes, and as the old folks used to say, yeah, that texture is everything. Okay, so last quick thing. This is from. Where did I order this from? Luxurious Body, right? Luxurious Beauty? Hold on. Luxurious Beauty. Where beauty meets luxury. Uh, I've been seeing their stuff come up on my, I think my Instagram feed for a while. And I saved it and I finally, they had a really good sale. They were getting rid of, rid of their, their summer um, inventory, getting ready for fall or whatever. So I was like, this is a good time to try it. So I have a couple of things here. I love the box, the packaging. It's so cute. You know, I pay attention to all the details. So, we got peaches and cream and the body oil. Love that. Let's smell. Let's see what she's giving. Ooh. That smells, that smells like peaches. That smells like peaches and cream. I think I've run out of spaces to put things on my body. Ooh, that is peaches and cream. That is good. Now I will say you're not. This is not gonna be like a strong, overwhelming scent. Um, but it's it's there and it's good. And like I say, I always say with come to smelling good all day, layering, layering, layering. So even like this is peaches and cream, but you can I can get out the shower after I've done a peach body wash, a peach shower gel, get out the shower, do this, and then I can grab peach prosecco macaron from Bath Body Works and put that on top of that. You see what I'm saying? You see how it's going layer on layer on layer? Ooh, that's good. Peach is like one of my favorite scents, like of all time. Body care, fragrance, anything. Peach, peach, I will always love it. Actually, is there a peach perfume? I'm on the hunt for that now. I'm on the hunt for that. Then we got Pina Colada and the body oil. Let's see what she's smelling like. This, you could drink this. Keep this away from a child because it's as good as gone. This is as good as gone. And let me tell you, from just smelling this, you know what I would wear with this? Fresh Coconut Colada from Bath and Body Works. That's exactly what this has put me in the mindset of. Oh, you can't tell me this isn't a pina colada that you're supposed to drink. You can't tell me it's not. First of all, the shine on this. Oh my God. Yes. The layering, the layering, the layering. And then we just have this watermelon kiwi moisturizing body butter. Look at the color. It's like a pink and green type of situation because it's watermelon kiwi. Okay. I'm getting the watermelon kiwi. Now what this texture. Now see sis. Now I'm going to have to say this texture is it's a little hard to get this out. I'm having to work for it. Let's see. It does feel really good going on though. It smells good. It smells like a piece of candy. A piece of candy and some shea butter. That's what it smells like. But I, if, if anything, I would say that if you could make the consistency. I mean, who am I? Nobody. But for my personal preference, I would like the consistency of, to be a little bit more malleable, for lack of a better word. Um, but it's it smells good, though. And I got, let me see, off the top of my head. I would wear this with the um Pink Watermelon Blast. That we just got from Bath and Body Works during the last time my annual sale. That's exactly what I would layer this with. I'm giving y'all jewels. I'm dropping jewels. I'm dropping jewels right now. <laughs> okay, so that is all um, for this little collaborative black owned body care haul. I have other, I believe I do have other um, black owned businesses that I bought from that are body care. I just did one for Ancient Cosmetics. Go check that out. Um, like I said, I have my black on playlist, so it's not the only one, but I didn't have, I didn't feel like I had enough of one thing to do, like, each individual business, so I said, just put them together. Um, if you have any suggestions for, like, black on businesses that you, like, you know, 
you've bought from them before, you think they're very reputable, you think it's worth investing, or you think it's worth the money, um, let me know. Drop it down in the comments. I love to support small loan businesses. I don't know. It just does something to my heart. I love it. Um, and I think that's all. Again, if you like my content, you like my vibe, you like what's going on here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I believe that's all. I'm over here shining, greased up, smelling like pina colada, watermelon, strawberry, strawberry cheesecake. I smell like everything right now. <laughs> but that's okay. I'm smelling good. All right. Thank you. I love you all so much. I'll see you in my next one.